She is a beauty humid day out today. Where's my truck? It's actually, it's over there. It's around the corner. What's going on guys? How's it going? Happy Tuesday. Tuesday. <clears throat> There's something in my throat apparently. <clears> throat> oh, sorry. So yeah, I just got back from um, a Detour Village, Michigan. We were up there for a week. Just on vacation with Amber's family. It was awesome. So much good times that we did everything. We went out for dinners. We made tons of custom dinners. Everyone, uh, each day, each uh, person has to make a dinner. So that was fun. We did side-by-siding almost every day. We went golfing. Uh, went to the beach. We we just did it all, guys. We did it all. So anyways, while I was gone, these tires finally showed up. So those showed up right before I left. And then there was a problem with Pure Later or something. And these got held up at the shipping depot. So they showed up while I was gone. I was hoping to have them while I was there, but unfortunately they didn't show up till I was gone. But yes, these are the new weapons, the STI chicanes. <clears throat> and then we have the, the bronze rims over there. I will show you guys, hold on, I gotta put this down for a sec. These are the weapons. So they're beadlocks, they're bronze or copper, whatever you wanna call it. Bronze, that's it. Boom. And yeah, so I'm excited to put them on, get them mounted, hopefully today, and then get them on the Maverick here. So I gave this thing a good wash when I was up north, but I could only do so much of it. So I missed a few spots in there, but uh, I'll definitely, hopefully give her a huge wash today. Um, other than that, yeah, it's just been super busy. So I'm home now. The, <clears throat> the videos will be coming out, obviously, this, this week. They started Sunday, and they go until Thursday or Friday. I think I did five or six videos up there, but... A lot went on. We uh, rolled two Polaris's, rode off a Polaris, well, ripped the front arms off, bought a new Polaris, um, went mudding with the Mavericks. We um, went on a massive tour to Drummond Island one day. And uh, yeah, I just had a ton of fun. There's so many trails up there. I wish we had trails like that back here. So, um, broke the fender off the trailer. I uh, got a few caps from cars I gotta take in. The dirt bike, I haven't been on the dirt bike since my crash. I'm pretty much healed up now. I still got a little bump, but all the bruising is gone down there. So I took a handlebar to the crotch, if you guys are wondering. It's not that fun. It's not as fun as they say it is. So I picked this Ryobi hand sprayer up while I was up there. My brother wants an electric sprayer because he, uh, he whitewashes the greenhouse. So he's using the greenhouse now. He's growing vegetables, not marijuana, if you guys are interested. So he's doing all organic. If anyone needs some vegetables, that's where he's doing it. And uh, yeah, apparently you don't want the, they're pit super picky and you don't want the greenhouse too super hot. So you gotta like spray the outside white and keep it cool in there. Who would have thunk? So anyways, let's go get Toby and uh, smash out some Toby Tuesday questions here. Toby. Let's go for it. Come on. Hey buds. He's waiting to go, eh? <clears throat> Waiting to go. Did you miss me, Tope? I've been gone for a week. You need a brush. Oh, I feel like I say this every time. Every time you come here, you got more hair. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. All right. Back beyond the house here. I was just trying to find a nice sheltered spot. It's a bit breezy today. <clears> that <throat> throat is screwed. I keep hearing loud noises over there. It sounds like the neighbor neighbors are making noise, but apparently there's a little storm coming. Doesn't look too bad yet, but there's a little shaker rolling into town. Gonna make it rain. Hey, Tobes, we're gonna make it rain? Hey, buds? <laughs> He's like, I'm already over it. It's hot AF. I think there's a heat warning today, actually. Doesn't seem too bad. It's like 30 degrees or 32. I don't know. I don't know, Tobes. You're just happier than a pig and crap, eh? Hey? Eh? Did you have a good week without me? Didn't get tormented? Hey, buds? <laughs> You're funny. All right. <clears throat> Toby Tuesday. Toby-ish on the Tuesday. I'm going to get some shade here. It's a little sunny. Sunny bunny. What do we got? There's a ton of questions lately. I love it. So we got some big news too. I am not going to tell you what it is, but there is a new vehicle coming. So hopefully we're just getting it dialed in this week and then hopefully within the next... A uh, week or two, we'll have it, <clears throat> and then we have it for a couple months. So I'm gonna be. You guys should be pretty excited. I'm pretty excited. It's diesel. So 
get excited. <laughs> um, Danny Vaughn, are you from Ontario? Yes, yes, I'm from London, Ontario. Well, not London, I'm like north. A bit north of London by like 15 minutes, but I like it. I live in the country and I'm like the perfect distance away from London. Like I'm not in the city, but I'm not too far. Like I, if I need to go to the gym or the grocery store or the mall or any of that crap, it's like, you know, 10, 15 minutes away. So, right Tobes? Hey? <clears throat> what is in my throat? <clears> throat> yeah. Been on vacation too long, apparently. Um, Chris, Chris Roshan, rockin'. You should drive the cars after you jump them. <clears throat> well, once in a while we do. Like 90% of the time, the cars are pretty written off by the time we're done with them. Like, you know, the wheels snap off or the frame snaps off or they're pretty effed after. But we have done a few videos where we've driven them and we've actually jumped the cars twice. <clears throat> I think our record's two and a half times. We made it two and a half or three times, but the, the third time kind of just went off the side, rolled off the side. So. <clears throat> we do as much as we can, but yeah, that Jeep jump, there's nothing left of that thing, that's for sure. She ain't moving anywhere. I'm actually a little worried about trying to get it loaded on the quad, or on the uh, on the, um, the trailer, not on the quad. Speaking of quad, I need to start doing some more quad videos. I've kind of been avoiding it again. I get in these routines, you know, just depending on what time of year and what you guys want to see. We'll get doing car stuff and we'll get doing dirt bike stuff. And yeah, I just get into a routine and I'm like, frick, I, sh I, I forgot I have a quad too that I should be doing videos with. So hopefully I'll get that out soon. Um, Danny Jr., are you back home now, Mark? Yes, yes, I'm back home. I got home Sunday night and uh, uh, as you can see, I'm home. This is home. We're home. And um, But the videos will be posting throughout this week. So they'll be up till Thursday or Friday from... Uh, from the Michigan trip there. So there's lots of side-by-side -side action too. So I've also been adding music in the background of videos. <clears throat> I, I Obviously a lot of people do it and Amber suggested I do it. So uh, I know you guys like to hear the engine noise and the noise of what's going on. So I kept that in too and then just kind of added some quieter background tunes. So let me know if you guys like that. Uh, Zeke the King Games. Can you do a demo derby with all the junk cars? Well, we already did. We did one, what was that, three weeks ago now? So it was a massive pain in the ass because it took me like two weeks to find all these cars and a lot of money. I had to, you know, shell out all the money for the cars. So, and then picking up all the parts after and then taking them back to the scrapyard. There's still cars down there that I need to take back to the scrapyard. So, um, you know, maybe down the road we'll do another one, but I'd rather just go to a demolition derby and film that instead. <laughs> it's a lot easier. So, but yes, I'm uh, trying to line up more cars for us soon. So, um, Robert Livingston, you should pull all the airbags out of the cars and start blowing stuff up. We actually did. We started uh, pulling them out in the spring and then uh, we, we were having trouble igniting them. So I don't know if a few were duds or whatever, if we did it wrong, but I think one or two blew up, but uh, I kind of threw it off to the side for now, but yes, I gotta start uh, pulling airbags out. I mean, we got so many cars, we might as well just rip these airbags out and save them for a rainy day. Rainy day video, right? So thank you for the suggestion. We'll definitely start doing that. Um, all right, last question. Acidic Tuber, can you do more balloon vlogs? Ooh, that is a, that is a good one. Usually with hot air balloons, they're not, uh, not a lot of people want to see them. Actually, I did do one hot air balloon setup video and it's doing really well. I think it's like half a million or something. Um, I think obviously when you search hot air balloon or hot air balloon setup, it's the first one. So a lot of people watch that, but when I usually just do a normal hot air balloon video, they only get like a few thousand views. So, but yes, every time I help Zan chase, I will film it and uh, do more hot air balloon videos. So I can only do so many videos at a time. There's only enough, there's only so many hours in a, in a day, right, Tobe? Only so many days in a week. So we're doing the best we can with what we have. And yeah, we're enjoying it though. I love it. I love it. Every day is different. It's always a race with, or a contest with yourself on YouTube. How do you improve yourself? How do you make things better? What do you change today? What do you change tomorrow? So um, obviously, you know, we all want to grow and make more and do more and travel more and just do more and more, right? So. Um, yeah, hopefully within the next couple of weeks, we'll get more stuff dialed in, more collaborations dialed in, and 
yeah so thank you guys as always make sure you check out the links below make sure you check out sti tires because they sent over those tires for us so no oh, there's a generator i don't know if the power went out or if it just uh if it's just doing its test i think it starts up every two weeks on monday so she's running now this generator runs her house but anyways thank you guys as always check out the links below support the team support the sponsors you know without them it'd be tough to do all this youtube stuff but uh yeah so anyways topes anything else we out later bye